Give away too much mm. It's like I've got no sense of touch I'm always pouring out my heart No little by little here I'm always pushing things too far Two, five, six, ten drinks at the bar no boundaries, I get too close No little by little here Cause I give my all oh, no Hello everyone, how are you doing today? This is Steven with Divine Mobile Home Central In today's video, we are back out at Wayne Fryer in McClendon, Florida Today we're going to be touring this beautiful double wide manufactured live oak home which is called the shelby let's go over here and take a look at the description of the home all right so this is the home's information right here it's in their oak classic series and uh, feel free to look at the um you have paused your video and you can look at the information. So look at this beautiful exterior though. This house really has curb appeal. Look at it. Look at there. True, it's a true showstopper. Let's take a look around the back. Oh yeah, I just did that house right there. It's called the Cedar River. If you want to check out that video, I'll put the link up in the iCart above. Now, before we continue on, I just want to give a very short disclaimer. I do not sell these homes and I do not work for the dealership or the manufacturer of these homes. I record these videos because I love and enjoy touring these homes, and I love sharing all the homes that I view with each and every one of you. If you have any additional questions about finding this home, or pricing, or additional specifications, the dealership's contact information will be down in the description box. Thank you. Wind is really picking up out there. <laughs> oh, wow. All right, so we are inside now. All right, so the first thing you see is your living room. You have your gorgeous living room. Now, your eyes are truly drawn to that entertainment center. Look at that entertainment center. It is absolutely huge. Let's get you all a view from another angle here. I like the fact that they have the transom windows above the regular windows. So 
So there you have your um, can recess lighting. Boy, you could, you could fit a lot of furniture in this house, a lot of furniture. Now, this is, what, this is how they have it set up, but, you know, you can put whatever you want in here. Uh, let me know what you would put, the, put in this living room down in the comment section below. A view from another angle. Look at all that cabinet space. Look at there. Very rich oak wood cabinets. Give you all a sample right here. Okay. Let's check out the dining room and then we'll look at the kitchen. So this is your dining room area. Have plenty of space in this dining room. I love the... Uh, love the arch, uh, um, the tray ceiling right there. It gives it a very elegant touch. Now, right here, they have a six-seater, but if you, I imagine you could put an eight-seater here if you really wanted to. And there's plenty of space right there for a buffet hutch if you want, or a cabinet if you wanted to add one. All right, let's check out the kitchen area. So this is your kitchen. Very nice kitchen. It's a very unique kitchen. I really like the uh, shiplap right there with the floating shelves. Plenty of space where you can, you know, for, um, for prepping meals or entertaining. I really love this space right here. A view from another angle. Got cabinet space right there. Cabinet space right there. All right. These cabinets are so tall, very tall cabinets. Of course, you would have your sink right here, you know, uh, farmhouse sink, you know, you can, uh, and of course, I really like these two windows right here. All right, so of course, you'd have your uh, stove right here. You have your uh, European style hood frame. Again, I like the towel backsplash that they would have right here, too. Overall, this is a very nice kitchen. Let's check out the utility space. Yeah, this leads to the master bathroom, but we'll check that out in just a bit. So this is your utility room. Of course, that'd be the space right there above your um, counters. And right there be your electric panel box. Okay, so over here be your central heat and air. You also have your water heater right there behind the access panel. And you have, uh, this is probably, probably like a coat closet, but I'll probably use it as a, um, 
a pantry. So I'll probably add a couple extra shelves and use it as a pantry. All right, let's go check out the bedrooms. We got more house to look at. All right, so this will be your uh, hallway guest bathroom. There we go. You have plenty of space in this uh, guest bathroom right here. You have your double sinks right there. You have this huge mirror. This is a big, big mirror. Okay. Of course you would have a drawer space. Have your commode right there, and as well as your shower. Look at that shower. Overall, this is a uh, very nice uh, bathroom. Very nice big bathroom. All right, let's check out the bedrooms here. Sorry about the chirping. It's nothing I can do about it. Um, it may be the batteries. They may have to be replaced or be reset. So, All right, so this is the bedroom. Let's be very brief with the bedroom. All right, let's take a look at the closet. It's a nice size closet. Here, let me turn on the light real quickly so, uh, so you can see better. There you go. Get y'all a better view of the closet. All right, let's go check out the other bedroom. All right, so this will be your second bedroom. Plenty of space in this room. Let's check out the closet. All right, you guys, so let's go check out the master bedroom. But before we do, if you made it this far in this video, uh, and if you are new here, uh, I invite you to subscribe. If you like this video, definitely give it a big thumbs up and definitely share the video to help our community grow on this channel. And I really appreciate it. Again, thank you. All right, let's check out the master bedroom. All right, so this is your master bedroom, you guys. Plenty of space in your master. Let's get you all a view from another angle here. All right, let's check out the master bathroom. This is a really nice master bathroom. Okay. Okay, let's take a better look at it. So it just came in there. You have your uh, countertop. You also have storage space right here. Of course, you have your mirrors, you have your vanity lighting. Of course, you have your cabinet space. All right, take a look at this uh, beautiful garden tub. Look at there.
All right. Put beautiful garden tub. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Look at this closet. Plenty of space in your closet right here. You also would have a built-in cabinet in this closet too. I might be jumping ahead myself, but we'll take a look at the rest of the bathroom in a moment. But look at this closet. It's a big closet. It goes all the way over there. Get y'all a view from another angle. And of course you have a uh, door space right here. And as well as cabinet space. Plenty of space for shoes and knickknacks and purses and you know whatever you have. All right, let's check out these spaces. See that? So be your uh, commode room. And all you have to do is shut the door if you don't want to look at it. And of course, right here, this will lead right back into your utility room. Right back into your utility room. Okay, let's check out the shower and then we'll wrap up the video. And of course, this is your master bathroom shower. Look at the shower here. Plenty of space in your shower. You have your Rainmaker shower head and you have this very unique and gorgeous uh, tile. And guys, this tile is hand laid. Hand laid tile. Of course, plenty of space. All right. All right, you guys. Well, that will conclude the tour of this home. If you are interested in, in this Shelby model, uh, the dealership's contact information will all be down in the description box. They'll be more than happy to answer any questions that you may have. Well, this was the Shelby by Live Oak Homes. A very unique double wide indeed. This is Stephen with Divine Mobile Home Central, your central source for manufactured modular home tours and more. I will see you all in the next video. You all take care and have a wonderful day. I always give away too much. Mm. It's like I've got no sense of touch. I'm always pouring out my heart. No little by little here. I'm always pushing things too far. Two, five, six, ten drinks at the bar No boundaries, I get too close No little by little here Cause I give my all Oh, no little by little I pour out my Rather jump and risk the fall I see no limits in the sky No little by little here No, no, got stuck on working on myself Thought I was wrong and needed help But I'm just different, something else No little by little Cause I get my oh, oh, oh No little by little I pour out my heart oh, oh, oh. No little by little here. I'm gonna go everywhere And be myself, no I swear I'm gonna give my all Bye.
all that I can, I can be Let me fly, let me fly Let me fly into the sky Let me be all I can be Let me be all I can be Let me fly, 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 let me fly